What's up ladies and gentlemen, as you could probably see, it was pouring. It still is pouring. If you hear the pitter patter on the windows, that's just because it's it's raining and it's not good. As you can tell, I am soaking wet. Just got out of the premiere of White House Down. So uh, the, the film, it stars Channing Tatum, Jamie Foxx, basically like uh, Olympus Has Fallen that came out uh, uh, in March. March, I think it was, maybe, I think it came out in March. Uh, and I saw that with my good buddy Ryan Abbott. White House Down, I went with my good buddy Aaron Robbins, but I wasn't going to record his voice outside because it's raining, and that would screw up the, the thing that I record my voice with. So, this is my solo review. White House Down, and like I said, it starts Channing Tatum and, and uh, Jamie Foxx, and I'm sure he's just getting off of uh, uh, Django Unchained, which was a very good film, and now he's playing a president. I forget what president he's playing. But he, uh, the White House, it gets, uh, it gets uh, attacked by uh, an uh, unidentified force, which gets, uh, you know, identified in the film. Which we're talking about the twist in this movie, it's, it's it's like the whole first half, second half is fine. The third half of the film, the last like fifteen minutes, last fifteen twenty minutes of this movie, in particular. It's very, like, it's, like, weird, you know. I didn't have a problem with it, I guess. I mean, you got Channing Tatum, and he's jumping out of windows, and he's he's being all Hercules-like, which is fine, because it's what he had to do and what he was capable of doing to help the situation. The, the, the you know, the acting is fine. The script is, is uh, the writing is, uh, it's okay. You know, some of the things in this film... They're a little over the top, uh, you know, some of it's a little unbelievable, you know, like, could this really happen? I'm sure I, w I was invested in the film. It's two hours, like, 20 minutes long. I felt like, I felt like it was dragging on a bit for a couple of minutes. I felt like the film could have been ended, like, one hour, 45 minutes, they could have ended up fine. But they dragged on and on. The film continued and continued. Now, as it went on, I didn't have a problem. You know, it was entertaining for as it was going, but it just it wasn't necessary to to have gone on for such a long time. You know, it's just it, it was ex it was very extended. Like I usually say, this could have been the extended version on the DVD, and then you know, the hour forty five minute version should have been, you know the theatrical but whatever it was entertaining the the combination between these guys J Jamie Foxx and Channing Tatum they have good uh, chemistry you know I really enjoyed their back-to-back -back. It was pretty funny comical I, I thought they did pretty good you know uh, just like their own oh, little buddy buddy thing they have to work together and they don't have a problem with that they don't they don't not like each other they enjoy each other's company very much I could tell uh, it, it was pretty fun to watch them on screen and, and how their friendship came to be and, and how this uh, Channing Tatum's character actually, uh, he, he mo proves himself, you know. He, he needs to prove himself in this film and he does that. I mean, the film is fine, you know, it's, it's really good. I enjoyed it. Uh, it. Well, it's not really good. It's, 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 it's something where you go see it. It's entertaining. But you don't have to see it again, you know. It's a little extended. It's a little long. You know, also in this movie, we've got we've got James Woods. Speak of the devil, that's Hades. It would be cool if he just went up to some random guy and said, Hey, I'm Hades, Lord of the Dead. Nice to meet you. But he, he brought... Uh, he's, he's good in the film. You know, he, he brought a good uh, liveliness to the thing, and, and he, he did what he needed to do. So oh, in the end, I, I got it. Uh, it's not as good as Olympus Has Fallen. I think uh, Olympus Has Fallen was a little better than this. But this is still, I, I enjoyed it. It was really entertaining. I'm giving White House Down a three and a half out of, uh, out of five stars. It's, it's a swell entertainment. Wonderful special effects and everything, like I said. But yeah, that's my rating. So thank you guys for watching. Subscribe. Tell me, did you enjoy White House Down? Are you planning on seeing what, uh, seeing White House Down? Comment below and, and let me know what your, your thoughts are on the whole thing. Do you like Ronald E. Merch? Emrich? 
uh, the, the whatever his name is, the guy who directed this, so you're a fan of his, let me know. Let me know what you think. Comment below on all of those those facts. Tell me what your thoughts are on the, t on, the on the movie entirely. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, thank you for watching this review. White House down. Over and out.